Tom went to see plastic surgeon Dr. Leif Rogers for a procedure that would actually trim his midsection and pump up his calves. You have to see this. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Good to see you. Are you ready for this? I am. So what we're gonna do today is augment this fellow's calves. I'm gonna have to mark the areas we're gonna actually take the fat from. And then we're gonna mark the areas we're gonna put it back in. I'm gonna take a little bit off of this area as well. So now let's take a look at the calves. The shape of your calf is not bad in terms of it. You know, you have some definition here. Tom is an ideal candidate because he does have skinny calves. That's the most important thing. And he has a little bit of fat to donate. That's it, so we're ready to go back. We're gonna be doing all this under local anesthetic, which means we have to numb him very, very well. Now this solution is going in between the skin and the muscle into the fat layer. The fat travels up through this tube and into this jar here. You can see the fat starting to come out. The mix of fat and fluid is already starting to separate. So now he's gonna wash the fat. It just gets a lot of the blood and other things in the fat mixed in at the, with the fat that we don't want. Rinses that out. So it's pure fat. So now he's putting the fat into a syringe and we inject it into the muscle of the calf. Just finished up. So we're gonna turn him over now and he's gonna be laying on his stomach. First, I'm gonna make sure we're through the fascia. We're now in the gastroc muscle. So we're putting this fat within all the muscle fibers. The muscle will still function perfectly well. It'll just be a little bit bigger. It will actually survive in the muscle. It doesn't necessarily have to be put into the environment in which it came from to survive. He's actually awake, so he can flex that muscle some. Point your toe for me. It's looking good. You finished up, and you can see there's definitely a difference. No one will ever be able to tell that he had anything done. And uh, when he flexes, they'll look just like his regular calves. Can't wait to see it, I'm very excited.